Hi, hello friends. Welcome to our channel, Face the Exam Audio Podcast. So, in the last video, we were discussing Class Six Social Studies NCRT based textbook lesson, the first city's introductory class. All right. So, in that video, we covered the topic Indus Valley Civilization Introduction and the extent and main sides in detail. I'll put the link in the description box and pin it in the comment box as well. All right. So, today. We will be practicing a few questions and answers based on the topic that we have already discussed in the previous video that is Indus Valley Civilization and the main sites. Interested? So let's get started. Into the first question. Before that, there will be 25 questions from this small portion and that to interesting questions. All right. So into the first question, Dash means a highly advanced culture with towns and cities, crafts and trade, literature and an organized form of government. I'll repeat once again. Dash means a highly advanced culture with towns and cities, crafts and trade, literature and an organized form of government. Absolutely right. You said the answer. Civilization. Yes, so civilization means a highly advanced culture with towns and cities, crafts and trade, literature and an organized form of government. Okay, into the second question. The first site excavated that belonged to Indus Valley Civilization. I repeat, the first site, not the second or third, the first site excavated that belonged to Indus Valley Civilization is absolutely right. The answer is Harpa, H-A-R-A-P-P-A, Harpa. Correct. Listen carefully. The third question is, what is the historical importance of the place Kalibangan? What is the historical importance of the place Kalibangan? K-A-L-I-B-A-N-G-A-N. Any idea? Kalibangan? Ah, okay. Correct. It's an Indus Valley Civilization site. Absolutely. So, Kalibangan is an important Indus Valley site. Into the fourth question, in which year Indus Valley site Harappa was accidentally discovered? That word is important, okay. In which year Indus Valley site Harappa was accidentally discovered? Correct, 1856. That in that year Indus Valley site Harappa was accidentally discovered. All right, into the fifth interesting question, okay. Uh, I'm gonna give you four options for this question, so listen carefully. Identify the place which is not an Indus Valley site. Hmm? Option number 1 is Eastern Uttarakhand. Option number B is Western Uttar Pradesh. Option number C is Northern Rajasthan. And option number D is Haryana. Okay, listen, listen. Once again, I am going to repeat this question. Identify the place which is not an Indus Valley site. Eastern Uttarakhand, Western Uttar Pradesh, Northern Rajasthan and Haryana. Yeah, exactly. Eastern Uttarakhand is not an Indus Valley site. So, I am going to tell you uh, in, in, in the important uh, states where you can find Indus Valley sites are Punjab, Haryana and outside India as well like Sindh and Baluchistan, Gujarat, Rajasthan, Western Uttar Pradesh in all these sites, uh, places you can see uh, Indus Valley sites. All right. Okay. Into the sixth question. Name the famous Indus Valley site in Hisar district of Haryana. H H that code remember yes Hisar district of Haryana the famous Indus Valley site is absolutely right Banavali B A N A W A L I Banavali is the Indus Valley site in Hisar district of Haryana yes into the seventh question name the famous river bank where Indus Valley sites Harappa and Mohenjo-daro were excavated I repeat listen carefully all right name the famous river bank okay where indus valley sites harappa and mohenjo-daro were ex excavated easy river indus all right so river indus is the answer question number eight identify the world's most primitive civilization that belonged to iraq Listen, this is a super important question. So, we, we already discussed about the world's first four civilizations in detail in the previous class. Okay, the question is, identify the world's most primitive civilization that belonged to a country named Iraq. What's that? There you are. The answer is Mesopotamia. Correct. M-E-S-O-P-O-T-O-T-A-M-I-A. Okay, Mesopotamia. 
into the ninth question the development of dash and dash led to the transformation of places to cities in ancient in, in in the ancient world okay so the development of dash and dash led to the transformation of places to cities in ancient world the answer is trade and commerce we have already discussed in the previous chapter that at the beginning people were concentrating on agricultural production and at the time when they were all focusing on one particular activity they started producing surplus food food uh, products i mean food items which is more than what is required for them and that's why some people started concentrating on other activities like trade and commerce literature crafts etc and that led to the transformation of that places to cities into the 10th question name three famous indus valley sites that is in pakistan okay name three important indus valley sites that is in pakistan simple question the answer is harappa mohenjodaro and chanhudaro never ever forget the third one because you might be very much familiar with harappa and mohenjodaro but not to that extent with chanhudaro so c h a n h u d u d a r o chanhudaro chanhudaro into the 11th question name the indus valley site that is 130 kilometers south of mohenjodaro okay i repeat name the indus valley site that is 130 kilometers south of mohenjodaro the answer is chanhudaro correct chanhudaro which is in sindh pakistan into the 12th question name two famous indus valley sites in gujarat interesting question name two famous indus valley sites in gujarat the answer is simple lothal and dolavira lothal l o t h a l lothal and dolavira d h o l a v i r a dolavira and lothal these two indus valley sites are in gujarat into the 13th question name the two engineers who accidentally discovered harappan site in 1856 so the question is all about the engineer engineers name the two engineers who accidentally discovered harappan site in 1856 john and william burton b u r t o n burton john and william william burton absolutely right into the 14th question simple question what is the other name of harappan civilization oh my god the other name of harappan civilization is indus valley civilization very easy question into the 15th question once the early humans started producing food they began to lead a dash life i repeat once the early humans started producing food they began to lead a dash life semi settled life not a settled life because they just started the food production only they don't have any shelter or nothing like that i mean strong shelter uh, something like that no that's that was not there so we can definitely say that they led a semi settled life all right into the 16th question indus valley civilization flourished approximately between dash and dash indus valley civilization flourished approximately between the answer is in the text that i am referring to it's mentioned that 2500 bce to 1500 bce and i've already discussed this point in the previous video saying that in in most of the textbooks you can see different different time range so just look at the option and if that is convincing for you if there is no negative mark go ahead otherwise it's purely up to you all right so i repeat the book that I, i am referring to has clearly mentioned it as 2500 2500 bce all right into the 17th question name the world's first civilization simple the world's first civilization is harappan civilization or indus valley civilization into the 18th question in which state does kalibangan the indus valley site belong to uh huh in which sta state of india does kalibangan the indus valley site belong to it's in northern rajasthan absolutely right northern rajasthan kalibangan repeat 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 northern rajasthan kalibangan northern rajasthan kalibangan uh, lothal gujarat okay correct 19th question john and william burton the two engineers who accidentally discovered indus valley site harappa while they were laying the east indian railway line company connecting the cities of dash and dash i'll repeat that question listen 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 carefully you can get n number of questions from this big sentence john and william burton the two engineers who accidentally discovered indus valley site what harappa 
correct while they were laying the east indian company east india railway company line connecting the cities of answer is karachi and lahore karachi and lahore both are in pakistan all right so that's all about the 19th question and now into the 20th question harappa the indus valley site is in pakistan you all know it right harappa the indus valley site is in pakistan identify the place in pakistan where it belongs to it's a simple question we have already discussed that in the previous video saying that the name is little bit confusing you might confused it with a place in india absolutely right the answer is punjab but punjab province is the answer for this question so harappa the indus valley site is in pakistan and identify the place in pakistan where it belongs to and the answer is punjab province which is in pakistan province p r o v i n c province punjab province removing or finding something by digging is called as what's that process name called removing or finding something by digging correct excavation into the 22nd question name the culture that led to the beginning of civilization either the, the you can you can expect this question as one mark question or even uh, fill in the blanks question or whatever type of question name the culture that led to the beginning of civilization the answer is the culture of the development of cities led to the led to the beginning of civilization whenever city formation happened that led to the beginning of civilization okay into the 23rd question name the world's first four civilization very easy very important first one is harappa second one is mesopotamia that's in iraq right third one is chinese and fourth one is egypt egyptian okay now close your eyes close your eyes repeat repeat first one is correct harappa second one is exactly mesopotamia third one is chinese superb fourth one is egyptian there you are now you know the answer so the world's first four civilization is harappa mesopotamia chinese and egyptian absolutely brilliant into the 24th question name the seven sites of indus valley civilization just seven sites because see we are all focusing on the sites that uh, that we we were discussing in the text that i i was referring to in the previous class so i'll be uh, reiterating those sites in the order the first one is harappa second one is mohenjodaro third one is chanhudaro fourth one is lothal fifth one is kalibangan sixth one is banavali and seventh one is dolavira come on close your eyes into the first two points harappa mohenjodaro harappa mohenjodaro and third one is chanhudaro these three indus valley sites are in pakistan so come on the, the first three points in together together harappa mohenjodaro and chanhudaro absolutely right so the third question that the three sites are easy for you harappa mohenjodaro and chanhudaro into the fourth one is lothal lothal and uh, that's in gujarat kalibangan kalibangan is in north rajasthan banavali in haryana and dolavira so the fourth and fifth is lothal kalibangan lothal kalibangan so the first five harappa mohenjodaro chanhudaro lothal and kalibangan lothal and kalibangan banavali and dolavira banavali and dolavira okay so lkbd hmcc harappa mohenjodaro and chanhudaro you know these three sites are in pakistan so you can remember it easily or and after that lkbd lkbd is lothal kalibangan banavali and dolavira all right yes into the last question 25th question how far is chanhudaro site from mohenjodaro you have got four options how far is chanhudaro from mohenjodaro site option number 1 is 130 km south option number b is 130 km east option number c is 130 km west and option number d is 130 km north okay you are all familiar with 130 km but is there any confusion with north south east west no confusions at all 130 km south is the right answer so come on repeat 130 km south all right so this is all about the 25 questions from this interesting session and 
important point to study i want all of you to repeat the important invest indus valley site with me along with the place and also the country okay so we'll start with harappa punjab province pakistan come on harappa punjab province pakistan harappa punjab province pakistan next one mohenjodaro sindh pakistan mohenjodaro sindh pakistan harappa punjab province pakistan mohenjodaro sindh pakistan into the third one is chanhudaro which is 130 km south of mohenjodaro in sindh pakistan once again chanhudaro 130 km south south of mohenjodaro sindh pakistan so we have completed three one three three important sites sites in pakistan harappa punjab province pakistan mohenjodaro sindh pakistan chanhudaro 130 km south of mohenjodaro sindh pakistan pause and say for yourself all right so you are now thorough with the first three sites into the fourth one lothal gujarat india lothal gujarat india yes fifth one kalibangan north rajasthan india kalibangan north rajasthan india so lothal gujarat india kalibangan north rajasthan india into the sixth one is banavali hisar haryana india banavali hisar haryana so india and the last one that is the seventh one is dolavira gujarat india so in gujarat there are two important sites lothal and dolavira lothal and dolavira in gujarat the other two states are rajasthan what's that in rajasthan kalibangan and rajasthan northern rajasthan and what's that in hisar district of haryana banavali absolutely simple right so in sindh two sites were there what are they correct mohanjodaro and chanhudaro in punjab province haryana there you are so in northern rajasthan northern rajasthan kalibangan correct hisar banavali absolutely right gujarat lothal and dolavira oh my god you have finished the seven sites with names and country as well okay now it's super easy for you all right yes so that's all for now so in the next video we will be continuing the theoretical class of this same chapter followed by question answer session and the video goes like that hope you have enjoyed this video and if so please don't forget to subscribe this channel and share among your loved ones and like this content so see you guys in the next video till then love and love only study well best wishes for you from face the exam bye bye